Hello everyone, welcome back to Journal Output. It's me Zainab Altaf and today in this video I'm going to show you that how you can turn off Find My iPhone. It means how you can remove your Apple ID in Open Menu. The tool we are going to use is a really amazing tool which is going to support the new version of iOS that is iOS 15. It is. Uh, it means it is going to work from iOS 12 to iOS 15. So this is my iPhone 6s. Let me show you the specifications of my phone. It is uh, having iOS 14.8 as you can see here but it means that it is going to work for iOS 15 which is the latest iOS version. This is also going to support MEID and GSM both devices as mine is MEID from uh, by unlocking uh, your iPhone from this tool your sim call fix and everything is going to get fixed and also even you can reset your iPhone again so as you can see here from uh, my iCloud account here I'll show you that my find my iPhone is turned off I've turned on when I try to turn it off it is not being because uh, I don't remember the password let me show you this so as you can see verification failed it is not being turned off so we are just going to turn it off and i'm going to show you the whole process how we can do it so first of all let's go to pc's screen so now we are on the pc's screen and first of all i'm going to show you the website of the tool as you can see this is the link the all the links are in down description box you can easily check them out this is the very amazing uh, tool which is password activation unlocker here are some main points if you want you can read them out very very easily the point that that we need to note is that uh, removing apple id or fmi is now available for uh, from ios 12 to 15. It, is, it, it means that it is going to work for ios 15 which is the latest one now you might be thinking that um how this uh, from for what operating systems is going to work it is going to work for make and windows both operating systems you can switch in both of these uh, moving forward iphone a uh, bypass iphone ipad is stuck on activation lock this is an amazing feature which you can use for your iphone and here are some points you can read them out further moving uh if we scroll down here you can see here unlock iphone and lost mod without passcode this is um, uh, once again a very amazing feature you can read out the points which are written right here after that, you can see here, fix could not or unable to activate iPhone error. You can fix these type of errors by using this feature, which is really amazing. Unable to activate activation error, could not activate iPhone and, and etc. As you can see here, this is the one of the most important that we are going to use here. Turn or find my iPhone and iPod touch. Here are some important points. You can read them out. I'm going to tell you briefly how you can use this. Um, the next thing that we have is three steps to remove iCloud, uh, iCloud uh, iPhone activation lock. Here are three steps. You can read them out very, very carefully and you can do it very, very easily so this was all about the re a little review of this page now you might be thinking how you download it so scroll up and here is the option for free trial so let's click on it when you click on it uh, you are going to easily get downloaded click on save and let it download so now the tool is successfully downloaded let me show you here's the tool so now we are going to open the tool directly. We don't need to disable the antivirus because it's very, very safe. So let's open the tool. Now we are going to install it. So for installation, first we have to tick mark on this option that I have read and agreed the license agreement of password activation log. Just tick on it and then you have to click on this simply on this option, which is install. Let's click on this. This is very easily going to get installed. After that, now it might take some time. So I've just fast forwarded the video. Until then, subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to receive every new update on time. So as you can see, it is installed. Now we are going to open this. For opening it, you have to click on this option, which is a start. Let's click on it. So now it's just opening. So this is the tool right here, which is open here. You can see it is uh, written over here. Please select a feature. There are three features which are really, really amazing um, and very, very useful. So the first one is remove uh, iCloud activation lock. And the second one is unlock Apple ID. And the third one is turn off find my iPhone. So this is the feature that we are going to use in today's video. And I'm going to show you, uh, tell you briefly what you can do. After that, uh, before using this, we have to click on this shopping type of option at the top. Let's click on it. When you click on that, it is going to take you here and here are some licenses. Uh, one month license, one year license and one year license is containing a safe meg as you can see here. Uh, another is lifetime license and the last one is one year license. But here you will notice one thing that this is you can customize according to your demands and how many devices are you need on how many PCs. After that, these are the accepted method by this tool. Payment methods from here you can easily pay to this tool as you can see here. So now you can easily buy this from right here. I'm just going to close this. And after buying this, you have to click on this drop down menu right here. So let's click on it. And after clicking on that, you have to click on register. And here you have to give your email address and also your registration code that you have bought. So let's give it. 
After giving that, you have to click on register. That is right here. So it is just registering. So as you can see, very instantly registered successfully. It is successfully registered. And here are some other family members of the password which, which are very useful and you can check them out very easily from right here. So now I'll just close this registered successfully as you can see here. And now I'm gonna click on okay. Now I'm gonna show you that how you can use the feature. Now let me show you my phone. As you can see, this is my iPhone. As I told you before, fine, my iPhone is turned on. We are just going to turn off. So for that, first of all, let's connect your iPhone to the Windows. And after that, we're gonna click on trust to trust the computer. Then we are going to click on the third option, which is turn to find my iPhone, which is our case. And here you can see remove Apple ID. Now we are going to tick on this to agree the disclaimer. Let's tick on it. And then we are going to click on next. Right here. Now it is showing some steps. So we are going to follow all of these steps and, uh, and turn off find my iPhone. So let's do it. Let's go in our phone. And here we are going to first of all open the Safari. Let's open the Safari. And here we are going to type the website which is shown by the tool. So we're just going to follow the tool and click on go. Now we are here we are going to click on download certificate as the tool is showing. Now we're going to click on allow. Then we're going to click on close. And we are done with the three steps. Now on the tool if you move forward we are just going to close the Safari and open the settings. And here we're going to scroll down and click on general. Again, scroll down and click on profile right here. Now we're going to click on unlock Apple ID. Let's click on it. And now we're going to click on install. Again, install. Once again, install. Now we are done with it. We're just going to click on done. Now we're going to go back. And scroll up and here we are going to click on about. Scroll down and here we are going to cl click on certificate trust settings. Now here we are going to just turn on unlock Apple ID and click on continue as shown in the, in the tool. Click on continue. Now we're going to go back, again back, again back and here scroll up and here we are going to click on Wi-Fi. In the Wi-Fi we are going to open this uh, information button. Let's click on it. And, and now we are going to scroll down and we're going to click on configure proxy. Now, uh, let me show you in the tool. There are some other steps. Here we are going to click on menu. Let's tick on it. After that, we have to type down the server and the port which are shown in the tool. Type exactly what the tool is showing. And after typing that, we have to click on done. Now we are going to go back. Let's go back. Now here we are going to click on uh, Apple ID. Let's click on it. And now we're going to click on iCloud. Now in here, as you can see here, it is just loading the storage. And as you can see, this uh, storage is successfully loaded. We are done with this one. Now I'm going to click on next and it is just removing the device from uh, Find My and we have to wait for it. So like my video and share this video as much as you can. Now, as you can see, we are done with it. Now, we just need to verify the FMI status. So for that, we are just going to click on this. And uh, we are going to also copy the serial number because we need to paste it into the website. So after that, when you click on verify, the FMI status is going to take you here. Paste it and click on search. Now, it is just searching. So as you can see, find my iPhone is successfully turned off. As you can see here, it is successfully turned off from this website. We can easily see it. Now, I'm just going to close this. And as you can see here, I'm just going to type down the status, which is fine. My iPhone is turned off and click on confirm. Now I'm going to click on reset because I want to reset my iPhone. So let's click on reset. And now it's going to take a lot of time. So I've just fast forwarded the video again saying like this video and share as much as you can. Now we're on the hello screen. So now it is going to be get unlocked because it's unlocked. Now I'm just going to uh, select the language and select the country from my iPhone. And uh, going to give the internet password to it. So now it can take much time here, so don't worry about that. So as you can see, my iPhone is successfully activated and su successfully unlocked, as you can see here. Now I'm going to go do, do some other setups. Your Everything is going to get fixed, SIM call fixed, notification fixed, iCloud sign-in fixed, and everything is going to work in your iPhone. And then you can uh, reset and erase your iPhone. Now we are on the successfully on the home screen as you can see here. I'm going to go on settings and here you can sign in with your new Apple ID. And uh, let me show you the specifications. As you can see the same specification of my iPhone. I hope you understood whole the tutorial. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching the video.